Do you remember that guy in that classic motorcycle movie, Little Foss and Big Halsey? How about the Academy Award-nominated co-star of Bonnie and Clyde? Okay, do you remember that episode of Star Trek, the original series, where they go to a planet that is only populated by a few unruly kids? Yes, the oldest kid in that group, that guy. His name was Michael J. Pollard. Michael J. Pollock Jr. was born in Passaic, New Jersey, the son of Sonia and Michael Pollock, who were of Polish descent. He went on to study acting at Montclair Academy and the Actors Studio, along with such notable celebrities as Marilyn Monroe, aka Norma Jean, who was also in the same class as him. Michael changed his name to Michael J. Pollard, most likely for professional reasons, such as to stand out and be more memorable. Also, during that era, it was often deemed better to have a name with a less ethnic sound, such as Pollock or Pollock, or Polak. After his theater studies, he went on to perform in theater in New York and had small roles in television, including Alfred Hitchcock Presents. His film debut was a minor role in Hemingway's Adventures of a Young Man. Then, in 1967, he played the role of C.W. Moss in the classic film Bonnie and Clyde, for which he received an Academy Award nomination for Best Supporting Actor. He had a few more leading roles after that, such as the previously mentioned Little Faust and Big Halsey. As a side note, when Michael J. Fox had to change his name due to another actor already having the same name, he said Pollard was his favorite character actor, and that is why he added the J to Michael J. Fox. Because of his looks, voice, and height, Pollard was often relegated mostly to supporting roles as a goofy man-child or oddball character. But, as most actors know, any work is still working, and he always brought something special to every role. Over the years, Pollard had no shortage of work, with a total of 116 credits to his name on IMDb. This includes guest appearances on some of the most beloved TV shows over the past six decades, such as Gunsmoke, Lost in Space, Wings, Blossom, Mary, Indiana, Simon and Simon, The Fall Guy, and so many more. He later reunited with his Bonnie and Clyde co-star as Bug Bailey in the 1990s with Dick Tracy. He also had sporting roles in Roxanne and Scrooge. His acting career continued until his final days, appearing in such films as House of 1000 Corpses and Remembering Nigel. Michael J. Pollard died of cardiac arrest on November 20th, 2019, in Los Angeles at the age of 80.